Hello, Namaste, and welcome in the series of Cyber Security. This side is Meena, and today I will discuss about why do hackers want to edit registry. Actually, window registers registries are a database where the system stores information that's related to the user information of uh, applications software uh, about the hardware uh, about the system each and everything they store the information in a proper systematic uh, database okay? that is what register and it is work at low level programming which is very very powerful means in the background whatever it is run it, it will be just under the uh, or just it will be covered on the back end side for front for example we are uh, accessing any application say microsoft uh, powerpoint word or any application whatever it will display a front end so with the low level of programming it is just running on the background so, so that's why reason is hackers are always in the hunt to find out the ways they can they can just conceal themselves or they can hide themselves in a way so that uh, it will be very very difficult for users and for the security system to get identified okay and registry are the very very attractive options for them that's why hackers always in the hunt to just make changes in the registry so let's see what are the registries and different different uh, uh, we can say structure of it. there are basically five hives and in these five hives uh, the information that is related to whether uh, for example say first hive is uh, classic root okay? and the classic root will uh, hold the information that is related to the object linking and embedding registers clear and the current user who are currently logged in whatever the right they are having which applications they can access whatever the information that's related to the current user that exists on the current user okay and local machine this hive will contain the information that's related to the system data okay and the users on a computer there can be many users okay and even uh, there are uh, uh, system generated users so all the information about the user that exists under this hkey users and the current configs it is having the information about the hardware profile what are the devices you are using what devices are working uh, who, which application is accessing those devices all the information that exists in the current config so these are the five hives and why the hackers are in the uh, in, uh, having interest to make modification on it because uh, if something will change on the registry and say for just take an example of uh, keylogger for example uh, you download a software on the internet and uh, hackers also embedded some their uh, uh, malicious software inside it and it was uh, containing a keylogger when you install that software on your system so the keylogger will be also installed on it and they will just make the change over there and when you will start your system without your consent and without your knowledge and even that application will not appear in the on the front of uh, you can say so that we can look it as some kind of malicious application is running so before starting your uh, other applications it will already at the time of uh, starting your computer is already started so whenever you are uh, uh, entering your uh, passwords uh, or uh, other data they can see it okay that's why for the hackers they want to make changes registry so we must be sure about yes our registries are uh, secure 
it is not modified so that we can identify as some kind of uh, malicious activity or the registry entered on our uh, uh, registries uh, editors clear yeah. so it is very very important and hackers always just make changes uh, in the registry so that it is difficult to find out yes uh, where uh, that those changes are there okay and follow me on the cyber security prism and get the notification for the next interesting session and share that video with your friends and group members so that they will be able to understand what, what is the importance of the windows registries and why hackers are always in the hunt of uh, making changes okay and then the next session i will discuss about how to conduct a threat hunt if uh, some vulnerability exists in your systems on, on, on your programs then how to hunt what are the processes namaste see you in the next